Hi, I'm Dr. David Green with PreferPainCenter.com, where we bring you anything and everything related to pain management. The topic today is the future of low back pain with regenerative medicine. All the treatments that we have so far to date in pain management for low back pain involve basic Hi, I'm Dr. David Green with PreferPainCenter.com, where we bring you anything and everything related to pain management. The topic today is the future of low back pain. To date, there are 30 million Americans who suffer from low back pain on a chronic basis. That's 10% of the population. That's a huge number. And the treatments that we have for low back pain are not so great. Surgery works okay. Um, Things such as chiropractic treatment, physical therapy, over-the-counter medications like Tylenol and anti-inflammatories, those actually can work really, really well. But what I'm talking about is a subset of people with low back pain who it becomes chronic and it's just not going away. So the question is what to do about it. Well, there's a new study here in Arizona at Arizona Pain Specialists involving stem cell injections into the low back. And what that involves is regenerative medicine. Because to date, all these treatments that are being done are not regenerative or repair. They are simply proverbial band-aids of things such as steroid injections, radiofrequency ablation. These treatments work really well, but they don't fix the problem. They just mask it, okay? So right now, we have something that's workable, but there is a better way. And that's what this study is looking at. The company that's funding the study is called Mesoblast, and they're an Australian company. And in pilot study, which is a small study, they did show that these worked well, the stem cell injections into the intervertebral disc. So here's the theory behind stem cells. You have the bone marrow of your body, and you have bone marrow all through your bones, basically. And one of these is in the pelvis, and it makes stem cells. And when a stem cell is made, it's a clean slate. It can turn into whatever cell it is in the environment around it. So it can turn into a cartilage cell, a muscle cell, a skin cell, or a bone cell. So you do continue to make these throughout life. You make less of them than when you were a child, but you do continue to still make them. Now the term stem, I just put because you, know, you have a stem and it can turn into these types of cells. Now the study involves injections into the intervertebral disc. The intervertebral disc in a normal situation is 80% water. And there's collagen and uh, pro proteins called proteoglycans. But as we age, it tends to degenerate and your body turns into a prune, basically. You start losing water. So the study is designed to inject material into the disc space and help regenerate and repair in an area that has a terrible track record for regeneration and repair. It just doesn't, doesn't work. Okay, So huge promise for the study. Uh, to see if you're a candidate, call 602-507-6550. The study involves a randomization. So either you get the stem cell injections or what's called a placebo. And it's an FDA clinical trial. It's very exciting. Uh, it's the first of its kind, um, multiple sites around the country. This is the only one in Arizona. The pain doctors involved with it are board certified, fellowship trained, um, and they uh, have a very great, they have multiple locations around the valley. I'm Dr. David Green, PreferredPainCenter.com. Your pain stops here.